Hi everyone. So in this video, we will learn how to change a text on button click using JavaScript. So let's get started. First of all, we need a index.html file. So let's create one. We need a basic structure here. We also need a style sheet. So it will be style.css. We need a script file. So it will be script.js. We need one button. So let's add one. It will be change. We need one paragraph element. And it will have some dummy text. Now you save it. Create a style.css file here. Select body element. Display will be flex. Flex direction will be column. Justify content will be center. Align items will be center. Select the button element. Padding will be 5 pixel and 20 pixel. Select the paragraph element. Give it a width of 300 pixels. I think 600 will be enough. Let's give it 600. 300 will be too short. So just save it. Open this file in the browser. And this is the output. Now let's work on the script file. Let's go to code editor. Create script.js. Select the button element. It will be btn change. Select the p element. Let's make it p. Add event listener to this button and event will be click. Let's have some text here. So it will be this is hello world test application. Great. Now there is a property text content that you can utilize to change the text. So let's set it to new text. Save it. Go to browser. Click on change. And this is the output. Now as you can see, we are not getting line breaks here. If you want to get those line breaks, you should make use of inner text property. That will preserve the line breaks in your text. So let's change it. Instead of text content, you should go with the inner text if you want to preserve the line breaks. Just save it. Go to browser. Click. And this is the output. So it's pretty straightforward. If you want to preserve the line breaks, go with the inner text property. If you don't want to preserve the line breaks, then you can go with the text content property. I hope you got the point how it actually works. See you in the next video. Have a nice day.